Tell me about your poultry business. How long have you been in the poultry business? 30 years. What kind of items do you raise? I raise red wing piles and black straight corn bakiva chickens that come out of Ireland. I have two breeds of chicken. They haven't been listed with the National Poultry Program as complete breeds of chickens, but the world recognizes them. They're sterling blacks and sterling piles. Pile, P-I-L-E? Yes, sir. Pile means white. Do you have a, a separate business that you've incorporated where you conduct this business, or is this something you do just in your own name? Sir, I had a vision back when I was a child that nobody else in this world could recognize but myself. I know where Osama bin Laden is today. I know the cure for SARS today. I know many, many things of this world that other people don't recognize, and don't understand, and don't know. Simply because I follow the chicken. That sounds stupid. Sounds unrealistic to... You think it's childish. But the national bird is the eagle. But the international bird is the chicken. The chicken will carry you down the darkest alleys of the world safely. The eagle will take you down that road by yourself to get you killed. The chicken will take you down there and sleep you in the attics of Muslims. It'll sleep you in the hotels of kings and in the palaces of kings and queens. I live with the mayor of Djibouti. I live with the daughter of the advisor of the president of the Philippines. I've been to Guadalajara. I've been, if I sat here, I'd hate to make him have to write all the places I've been for the chickens. Lamadol, Jabutu, Butterang, CD, Gabadu, Mackinac. Wait a minute. You know what I'm saying? I've been around the world six times on the back of a chicken. I've Hang on, Mr. Pittman. I think you're losing the court reporter with some of this stuff. I didn't get none of that. Did you get the part about Osama bin Laden? I got that part. Okay, sir. Now, let me just back up because I don't want us to get off the subject. The question is... Lightning strike on me and then trees fall on me and hailstorms and rainstorms and snakes. I've bit by snakes and bit by spiders, stung by hornets and wasps and thieves have shot at me and everything else. You know why I did all that? For the chickens. Why would I do all that for the chickens? Because I said, like whatsoever you do, do it heartily as unto the Lord. I've been feeding those chickens for God for 30 years. Okay, what does a chicken have to do with God? God used the foolishness of the world to confound the wise, and he manifests his strength through weakness. I think you can reflect back on enough Bible stories to kind of get an idea as to what I'm referring to. In man's opinion, the eagle is the stronger of the birds, but the game chicken is really. The game chicken won't run. The eagle will. The chicken is the national bird, international bird. The chicken is man's best friend. Dog, you can say dog is a dog everywhere too, but the chicken is the international bird because it is the food supply for all of the human races. The man that knows the chicken as well as I do has a home in any culture of people on the face of the earth.